Hi, my name is Jenny Herberg. I'm 40 years old and live in Boise, Idaho. I'm a registered nurse and manage Quorum Infusion Specialty Services out of Boise, as well as the CEO and founder of the Idaho Business Council. I am the mother of two boys age 13 and 15 and have been married for 17 years. I have always led an active lifestyle as well as taught others the meaning of health and fitness. I run, bike, swim, do triathlons, and have coached just about every sport that my kids have ever played. I have a very strong family history of atrial fibrillation, or an irregular heartbeat. When I was 30 years old, my heart too started acting irregular, and I would have periods where my heart would beat really fast and then slow, until eventually it got to where my heart would only beat in atrial fibrillation. Initially, um, just getting used to the different medications was very difficult, but over the last two to three years, I got progressively worse. I got to where I could no longer do the things I enjoyed doing. I wasn't able to do triathlons anymore. In fact, last year I put on nearly 35 pounds because I could no longer be active and out exercising, doing my daily life. To always be the active and involved mother to now all of a sudden taking a seat and having to rest when I would get home from work at night really played a large impact and role and strain on the rest of my family. Being a registered nurse, I did a lot of research on the best treatment options and the best doctors available. Dr. Pai and his stereotaxis treatment was the safest and most effective way to treat my atrial fibrillation, and hopefully give me my life back. When I went into the office, I had already seen three cardiologists that I had decided I did not want an ablation procedure. Dr. Pai just happens to be the exact same age as I am, and unlike the other cardiologists I've dealt with, he treated me like a real person. He also let me know that he would treat me just as he would his own sister and really gave me the faith that I needed in him and the procedure to make myself well again. I arrived at St. Alphonsus at six in the morning, went up to the cardiac unit on the floor, and immediately the St. Alphonsus heart care team took care of me, made sure that I wasn't nervous. They did everything in their power um, to make sure I was comfortable. I was only there about an hour to maybe an hour and a half when they took me into the procedure room. I uh, don't remember much after that. I woke up about four hours later um, in normal sinus rhythm and very surprised at the fact that I woke up with no pain and literally didn't seem to have any problems at all immediately coming out of anesthesia. If I would have known how easy and simple it was going to be, I probably would have done it a lot sooner. As I stated before, when I woke up from my procedure, I as a nurse was astonished at the fact that there was no pain, there was no post-procedure complications. I literally walked five miles um, less than five days after my procedure. I should have known better. I wish I would have done it sooner. Um, I'm just really glad that I've done it now and if you are considering having this procedure done, I highly recommend it. In five weeks, I will be completely off any of my atrial fib um, medications, no beta blockers, um, no blood thinners, and I will be completely symptom free. Moving forward with my life since the procedure, I can plan on once again being active in the activities I like to do. I'm training for a triathlon, hoping to once again complete the Boise Ironman 70.3 next year. That is my big goal. I'm looking forward to being off of medications for the first time in 10 years and just once again being a normal person not set with my medication schedules or my atrial fibrillation. I have conquered atrial fibrillation and am ready to move on.